welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a review slash some lip swatches of the few ColourPop liquid lipsticks that I picked up so you should be interested let's just get it right into it so but first before we even get into the video um my hair it is old AliExpress hair a wig that I've had for a long time it's going to be linked in the description box I've done a review on it this is my hair you know what happens when you just go in your bag and you find hair this is what it is on my lips I'm not wearing anything but I'm not wearing ColourPop on my lips I'm actually wearing different combinations I'm not telling you what I have on I'll tell in another video when I give this makeup this makeup tutorial um so let's get right into it so I only picked up five liquid lipsticks from ColourPop because I heard so many mixed reviews on it and at this point I was just like I, I just want to see for myself so I decided to just pick up only five let's just watch them talk about them and before we get into the video I want to say that I'm not going to show you the natural color of these I'm actually going to show you how I would wear them I don't necessarily like looking at lip swatches with just the lip color on no I like to see how you manipulate it because it gives me an idea on how I could possibly wear it. So I'm just going to show you how I would wear the lips. So this first color here that I'm about to show you is Jellies. Now Jellies is a very pretty blue. It can, be, it can be intimidating when you see it. However, it's very pretty on deeper skin tones. I like to kind of ombre this blue and kind of give it a, a different look. I do not just put the blue on my lips and go. No, I like to ombre it with a black. You can also ombre it with like, if you're bold enough, do like a deep red, like this red, probably put blue in the middle. Um, I just do not wear this by itself because it's not fitting for my skin tone alone before applying my liquid lipsticks I like to put Vaseline on my lips the only Vaseline I use is from Family Dollar so I like to put that on my lips a little bit and then I apply my liquid lipstick I let that dry I put just a tad bit more here in the middle and then I apply the second coat a lot of people say that this these lips liquid lipsticks kind of crack and stuff like that and avoid just experiencing the whole cracking thing I do moisturize my lips and since I do that they do not crack on me whatsoever Okay, so the next one I'm going to show you is called Guess, and it looks like this. It's a very, very pretty deep, deep purple. Perfect for the fall time. I actually just did a tutorial featuring this lip. You can wear this alone. Now, this looks really good on any skin tone or color, honestly. Ranging from white to black, any skin color, this looks perfect on. Now, Potions is a lipstick that you can ombre, especially with a black liner. Or you can wear a brown liner and just put this on. Either way, you can definitely work with Potions, but you do not have to. This is a color that you can wear completely by itself and it looks really good. Alright, so the next color I'm going to go in with is called Trap. And this is what Trap looks like. It's just like a pinkish nude color. Um, it's really, really pretty. However, it is not cute at all, girl, if you're going to wear it by itself. Especially not for women of color. You definitely have to manipulate this and try a lip liner. For sure, Chestnut by MAC is very pretty. If not, you could have NYX Cappuccino, NYX Dark Brown. Um, any type of brown liner with this, just to smooth it in and make it look better, is perfect. But this by itself, it's just not going to look right at all. It just looks like, ah, not good on your lips, okay? This is one of the ones that can kind of... Um, create them lines on your lips if your lips are not moisturized and it can kind of crack so I apply a little bit of Vaseline and I'm good this will last me for a good four hours before I have to kind of like reapply but this is a very pretty color the next color which is actually my favorite is called Limbo and this is a brown color it looks like such now Limbo is another color that you can just put on your lips and just call it a day I like to just put on like liner you probably don't see the liner but I like to do it myself just to put liner on and then I go in with Limbo Limbo is very pretty now the thing with Limbo is that it does not look like what it looks like on the outside so the liquid form is lighter than the drying form which is perfect because it dries to a deeper darker brown and again all skin tones it works great very very pretty color if you're looking for a brown or something like that this is good lasts all day I really like Limbo now the last color I'm going to show happens to be everybody's favorite. This is LAX. Now this is supposed to be like a deep burgundy um, reddish color. Personally, this is not my favorite. And I got LAX because everybody looks so good at LAX. But it does not look so good on me. But it looks really good on other people. Especially if someone of a lighter skin complexion. Girl, this thing is bomb. Imani, she, Dollface Beauty X looks so freaking perfect in LAX. And I'm just like... I don't I don't look good I don't look like that it's a, it's a nice color um it uh, it's not for me it's not my favorite I reach for this never really <laughs> I'll try to figure out how I can 
fix this a little bit but you guys may just like lax but this is what it looks like in its form uh you could wear it with a lip liner you don't have to i've tried it with both and it still just does not work for me but that's lax Okay, guys, and that is just my swatches of the ColourPop, the liquid lipsticks that I, I just picked up a couple of them. Do I like these liquid lipsticks? Yes, I do, honestly. I know a lot of you guys trust my opinion and were waiting, was waiting for me to get this review up. I personally like them because I do moisturize my lips. Do they crack? I'm not sure because I don't give them the opportunity to. I just simply apply Vaseline just a little bit, put the um, lip stuff on, let it sit for the first coat, go in with a little bit of Vaseline and apply the second coat on. It's perfect for me. Now, when I do start to eat, that's when the color starts to transfer. But without eating or anything, they last a good four hours on my lips. I like them. Would I buy more? For sure. Because I do like them and I'm glad I didn't listen to everyone else, uh, else's opinion on them. Now, my thing is, Try them for yourself because the, I, it was just so many mixed reviews on them. I was just like, I'm going to get them. Uh, screw it. I'm going to get it. And I got them and I happen to love them. So, yeah, that's my um, whole thoughts on the ColourPop liquid lipsticks. Get you some, honestly. Get, just try it. Just try one, two. It don't matter. You don't have to go balls to the walls. I only did five. I'm just like, let me just keep it here, okay? Anyways, I'm talking too much. Hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, okay? And I'm Nini Tanay to all my new subbies. Hey, boo. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye, y'all.